the gloves are off as two ANC Limpopo heavyweights prepare to do battle. Limpopo Provincial Chairperson Stanley Matabata and the party's former PEC member and current NEC member David Masondo have been nominated to challenge current chair Gwere Mantashe. This won't be the first time that the pair encounter each other as adversaries. Masondo is one of eight MECs that Matabata fired during his maiden reshuffle in 2013. At that time, five provincial departments had been placed under administration. Right now, the current provincial secretary says the fact that two leaders from the province are vying for the same position shows that Limpopo is good at grooming future leaders. On the three candidates from the province, it, it means the province is growing. Um, as the PEC, we, we, we want to appreciate that, that uh, uh, amongst ourselves there are leaders that structures are identifying as leaders that are ready to lead the NC National. Critics believe Masondo's nomination is spearheaded by the party members who supported Matabata's opponent, Dixon Masimula, at the party's recently held provincial elective conference. Masimula and his entire slate lost the election. In terms of nominations, Matabata leads the pack. At least one political analyst believes Masondo should pull out of the race. One would say one of them should actually withdraw if they are disciplined, in particular Masondo. I would suggest that they should withdraw because uh, the number of nominations that he has received are, are by far less than those received by uh, Matabata. Madaja also confirmed that Matabata would be delivering the keynote address at an ANC gathering in KwaZulu-Natal this coming weekend. Rubbish in speculation that this is an indication that the PEC no longer supported Ramaphosa's bid for a second term. He needs to also campaign. Uh, and if he gets an opportunity to go to Gauti, he will also use that event also to try and demonstrate to the membership of the ANC that he's a capable leader, so he's going to KZN specifically for that. And, and, and I would want us to understand it in that context. Not in a context that, no, the PEC of Limpopo is now going to KZN to try and change its stance and everything. It's not about that. And, and, and you must understand that lobbyings, lobbyings are open up until to the conference, to the last minute where we'll be voting. So lobbyings are there. So I sit at here. I don't know whether the delegates from Limpopo who will be going to conference, they will be persuaded by the delegates from KZN. Bejani Chawuke, also from Limpopo, has been nominated for the position of ANC Treasurer General. Piman Baloi, SABC News, Polukwane.